Guten Tag. Good day. Howdy. Bonjour. Dobrý den. Konnichiwa. Buenos dias. And Juptivas. This is Asher This Week with me, Lars Klein. And this week, Microsoft Translator releases na na nine new languages. Azure Spring Cleaning sees a lot of services being retired and the private Azure Marketplace is here. Now on the 3rd of March, we at ACG are hosting another Azure exam prep live stream on YouTube. And on the back of the AZ900 walkthrough we did, this will be for the AZ104 Azure Administrator exam. Use the link in the description to join. If you still haven't signed up for Microsoft Ignite on the 2nd to 4th of March, then why? It's 100% free to attend and there are lots of great sessions on offer. There's also three sessions that I'm giving. Hmm. Now use the link in the description to register and we'll see you there. Microsoft Translator lets you translate real-time conversations, menus and street signs, websites, documents and more using the Microsoft Translator app for iOS, Android and the web. And it also lets you integrate all this translation goodness into your business applications by using the Azure Cognitive Services. This week, nine, that's nine, new languages for text translation in Microsoft Translator were released. Albanian, Amharic, Armenian, Azerbaijani, Khmer, Lao, Myanmar, Nepali, and Tigrinya. Yeah, this was in conjunction with the International Mother's Language Day of 2021. Now, I think that Microsoft Translator is becoming self-aware though. It wrote the blog post for the announcement itself, and my default search engine suddenly changed to Bing. Send help. It seems our friends at Azure have opened all the cupboards after winter and realized the cloud platform was a bit of a mess. This week, the great Azure Spring Clean of 2021 has seen at least 20 services and features being retired or a retirement date announced. These include version two of the Azure Media Services API and the associated client SDKs, Azure RM PowerShell modules, Classic Application Insights, AKS Legacy Azure AD integration, Network Performance Monitor, Azure Batch Cloud Service Configuration Pools, the G5 and GS5 Azure VMs Hardware Isolation with SAP HANA certification, community support for Python 3.6, and much more. Check out all the services being retired or, well, their retirement dates using the link in the description. Azure Marketplace is the eBay of cloud computing, a place where you can buy and integrate with thousands of first and third party apps and services. They're certified, optimized, and polished to a shine for your consumption pleasure. Private Azure Marketplace is built on top of Azure Marketplace to enable governance of which apps are available for deployment in your company. You can pick and choose the ones that comply with your company guidelines and service agreements. There is no word on the hybrid Azure Marketplace should be coming soon. Have you tried Microsoft Translator? Either way, give the video a thumbs up in your own language and then consider subscribing to the channel. Here at ACG, we create regular content from the world of cloud computing. As we say on the A Cloud Guru team, when you aren't sure how many languages you need to prepare this week's script in, seek and you shall cloud. So see you next week and keep giving us thumbs ups, cloud gurus.